Now, as the pilot of Chopper 13, she's our eyes in the sky, providing live reports during WJZ newscasts. Linda Nicole met Captain Cindy Thrift for Coffee With. Captain Cindy Thrift joins us with an update. Cindy? Hi, thank you, Lynn. That's right, we are on scene in the Inner Harbor. You've heard her voice on the air while she's flying Chopper 13 over the scene of breaking news. We did see a large group of people being evacuated. Now get to know helicopter pilot Cindy Thrift. Nicole and I visited the Maryland native at Martin State Airport in Middle River. When I was 18, I enlisted in the Air Force out of high school. I really wanted to do some traveling. So from there, I was a weather forecaster. And after getting out, I just wanted to pursue my dream. Captain Cindy has been flying helicopters for six years. She was employed as a weather forecaster for the U.S. Air Force and National Science Foundation. At the end of last year, Captain Cindy joined WJZ as Chopper 13's new pilot. Her workday starts early. Every morning you do a pre-flight, making sure that the aircraft is airworthy to fly. So that's huge. It's a big part. And before each flight individually, though, just checking weather, checking any airspace that you may not be able to fly in at the time, and just getting your route down and being prepared for it. Her job requires multitasking, flying, and reporting at the same time. Knowing where all the other aircraft are at the same time, that's a big part of it because then you don't have to worry about any happening. So talking to one another in the aircraft is, is a big part. And she says being a female pilot comes with its own set of challenges. It is a man's world out there, so you really just have to do your best to hold your own. The next time we toss to Captain Cindy in Chopper 13 for a live report. Baltimore City Police Department confirmed that there is a suspicious car located at 100 East Pratt Street. The story now you'll know more about her. We'll be right back.